what's up y'all here we are day number four it is september 4th and yes it is 340 i'm sorry 404 340 what i'm talking about what's up guys checking in here day four again so we are back in the studio it is september 4th 409 i'm about to get ready to coach uh, two classes, 4.30 a.m., 5.45 a.m. I would not mind still being asleep right now, even though my neighbor's dog was barking at 2.30 for at least 20 minutes continuous, which was definitely an awesome wake-up call in the morning. But So by the time he stopped barking, it was like 2.50, and I was like, oh, i got to be up in 10 minutes. So it worked out pretty well, to say the least. So anyway, about to knock these classes out. Go on our long, super long run, which at the moment I'm not looking forward to, but. Yo, what's up guys? So I'm here at the park horse trails. I know what you're thinking. I look super pumped up to do this right now. Or you're lying if that's what you think. It is, hold on. It is 7.22 now. So I just got done working this morning. I knocked out two classes, 4.30, 5.45. Uh, me and the loot dog are here So we're gonna knock out 15 miles Why why that's we a great question this marathon. <laughs> So we, we want to get day. one long run in before the marathon. I know I've been saying that on here um, So we're at the park horse trails. It's a trail over here in San Juan Metro Park. Uh, it's a pretty cool trail Not when you're doing 11 laps, but it is pretty cool when you're just coming here for one lap like normal people do I'm gonna wipe this screen off real quick the uh, the Acre Marathon, from what we've heard, is pretty hilly. And if you've ever run this park course, it's a hilly, it's a hilly little segment. So, I figure this will get us ready or destroy us, make us quit. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be not quitting. We might want to give up multiple times, but we're definitely not going to quit at all. Um, but that's going to go ahead and get after it. People out here playing with their dogs. I wish I could go out here with a rim dog, but. I may never see the rim dog again. <laughs> Yo, all right, we are not even halfway yet. We're just over a third. The workout's paused right now, but so we got 5.73 miles. Um, I'm actually gonna take my phone on this next lap and show you guys what the course looks like. Luke, how we feeling? I'll tell you what, the hill, if you were on the park course, the hill at the end is pretty tough. The last, what'd you say, quarter mile? Yeah, it's brutal. It's a doozy. Also, it doesn't help that I have to go to the bathroom extremely bad. And I'm going to have to suffer for another probably hour and a half before that happens. So, we'll check back in. Coming up on your left, for Luke, this located is short. Yeah. Back to memory. Good times. Right there, baby. Right there. Luke's shoulder popped out of place. He's been ugly ever since. <laughs> and here we are, guys. The ascension. This is where boys turn to men. Or give up. Or give up. I'm going to good girl, Taylor. Oh, boy. Here we go. You can get a picture of her. Whew. Now it's just a steady hill for the next five minutes. Uh.
Still climbing. Yo, all right, we are here. We are just over eight and a half miles. So we're on the we're on the amends. That's the right terminology. We're on the I don't know. We're slumbered. <laughs> yeah, we're dying. We we gotta stop a couple times that last that last uh, lap. Can't even think now. Um, the hips are hurting a lot. We're dodging a lot of stumps and rocks and picking our legs up a lot more than a typical flat ground. Oh, for sure. And we're facing our souls right now, mirror to mirror, mirror face. Whatever you want to say. On the positive, the humidity is not too bad right now. We're in the shade pretty much 90% of the time. So We're going to drink a bunch of Kool-Aid afterwards. <laughs> we have no Gatorade and no electrolytes at all. So just uh, living on a prayer here, to say the least. All right, guys, we are on the last lap here. We are freaking dead. Let's see the watch real quick. 13.6 miles, we got 1.4 to go, one more lap. And oh. I want to cry, Luke's not not pretty bad. My legs are completely not up. I fell down. <laughs> yeah. I fell over on a rut. Get a little scraped down. On a rut, you hear that, Minnesota? On a rut. <laughs> on a rut. <laughs> All right, guys, so we'll check back in. Hopefully it's 20 minutes. Our pace has dropped significantly. Oh my goodness. We are closing out here, guys. 15 miles. Uh, the hardest thing we've done in a long while. 100,000 yeah. meter row, 300 burpees, that's nothing. Yeah, that was miserable. That was definitely a lot of mental toughness. I'm sweating like crazy. Oh my goodness. Here is the final, oh, it says the distance. Yeah. So 15.02 miles in the top left hand corner. Total elevation gain, almost 2,000 feet. Um, took us about five minutes short of three hours, so Safe to say I don't plan on doing anything like that in the near future Except for the marathon except for the 26 <laughs> <laughs> But at least that's that's not even flat ground either so either way we're just screwed So I'm back at the house. I am about to stretch out and roll out here. I guess I'm recovering the process 15 miles absolutely destroyed me. My legs are stiff as all can be right now um, I do have to coach again in about two or three hours and mind you I do have a six-month-old puppy who has been in his cage for most of the morning So when I want to come home and relax, that's not the easiest thing to do. So he's outside playing right now I'm trying to get the stretching rolling out while he's out there And we are here back with another episode of Get a Dog, they said. It will be fun, they said. Oh yeah, I'm in the shower and Remy is just going to town. You know what that is, right? That's the foam roller I was just using earlier. What are you doing, bro? Caught red-handed. Blue-handed. Literally, blue-handed. I see it right there. Bro, why'd you do this? Huh? What pleasure did you get out of this? Why? I, I know you know you weren't supposed to do this. That's why you look like that. Here, here, you still want some? Here, you still want it? Here. Eat it. Take it. Take another bite. 
Take another bite. Bro. And fun stuff. So he done this before, not with the foam roller, but with my comforter. This kind of stuff doesn't make me mad. I am annoyed that I have to pick up all the pieces, but he is a puppy and this is a foam roller. I'm not gonna let it ruin my day. I don't even care. I'm just gonna clean it up. I the only thing I'm mad about is having to pick it up, but one of those things where in life you can't let things like this ruin your day, ruin your mood. Like it is what it is. It's a thirty dollar foam roller. It sucks, but it's not a big deal. Like life's gonna go on. What's up, guys? So closing out the night here. Uh, finishing up my video from yesterday. Um, haven't filmed that much this afternoon. I got done doing that run, and it literally destroyed my life. Um, I got home. Um, I stretched out. I know I filmed that, and then Remy destroyed the foam roller. Filmed that. Um, and then I went to work. I taught three classes. I had Chipotle for dinner and I just been super busy. I just did my fourth cold shower. This was the hardest one so far. Um, just cause I've been planning them. The first two were all like right after I got done running or working out. So I was hot and I was like sweaty and my body temperature was already high. So it worked out well, but this one was just like, I mean, it's 10:30 right now. So super late. Um, that was tough. So. Uh, closing out the night, and I'm going to do better on film more tomorrow, but we'll see you guys on the next episode.